Wow. I actually raced straight home after work uh, to grab my coffee and get right downstairs into my my little official news desk here um, to get this out before having dinner at my local Taco Bell where I will eat alone, where no one can judge me, and I'll throw the wrappers out at Taco Bell as to destroy the evidence. I actually got my hands on the upcoming and already controversial Donald Trump 2020 re-election ad, and, and as you might expect, it's surrounded in controversy. Now, I'm going to get to the ad in a second here, but geez, I can't, I mean, wow is like the only word that I can really think of. Um, not only is this ad um, literally rustling 100% of the jimmies, uh, it's already the subject of two separate uh, copyright lawsuits from people who have claimed to come up with the idea originally. And I've actually spoken to these people, and I'm going to share that with you a little bit later. But um, what I'm going to do now is ask you that if you have any small children or kitties in the room, uh, that you have them leave because what I'm about to show you might be disturbing. Now, while I think we can all agree that filling the streets, however <laughs> sparsely, uh, to literally scream at the sky is an exceedingly effective way uh, to get Donald Trump reelected in 2020, uh, this ad brings with it a bitter, embroiled lawsuit between two women who both claim uh, that their fathers are both powerful attorneys and that they have, in fact, come up with this advertising strategy. First we have, let's call her Mrs. Green Jacket to protect her identity. Uh, claims She claims to have invented the scream into the sky at nothingness way back in 26 November, 2016, and uh, even has video evidence uh, of her enacting the now claim to be patented screaming pointlessly. Let's go to that footage. Donald J. Trump is now President of the United States. President Obama is the next President. And Mr. Trump, for the moment, steps away from the United States. It's a great honor address. to be able to introduce for the first time ever any. Hmm. Interesting. Now, the individual who is both suing Green Jacket Girl and Donald Trump himself has claimed to invented the scream aimlessly at nothing marketing technique and has allegedly been doing it since before it was cool. Now, when I asked when exactly was it cool, she couldn't exactly say, but was very certain that she had been doing it since before such a point. Um, now, let's go to her footage. Trump! Hey, look, it's a dead zombie! Are you on to do it? Now we showed this footage in, to Mrs. Green Jacket, and she has actually, in fact, issued an apology and hopes her sister in arms will forgive her. I am so sorry <laughs> to my world. I am so sorry to my world. This is not what we want. <laughs> wow. <laughs> just a few months of this puny little YouTube channel, and when I started it, I just never could have imagined uh, that it would be able to use its reach to bring together two such forward-thinking, progressive minds. It's, it's kind of humbling, to be honest. Now, I don't know how this lawsuit is going to shake out. I, for one, am not going to pick sides, but I am curious what all of you think. Uh, who, who did it better? Who do you think is most original? Uh, I'm hoping that you'll let me know in the comment section down below. I honestly don't know, but what I do know is this upcoming election cycle is sure to be chock full of delicious memes that I can, I for one, can hardly wait for. I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> 
You all, the growth of this channel has been absolutely amazing. The support, your emails, your direct messages, I've been completely blown away. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart. Um, many of you have reached out and asked how to support the channel. And there are a ton of ways to do it that don't even involve uh, giving up your hard earned cash. Uh, you can always reach me. You can follow me on Twitter at um, twitter.com slash the quartering. You can find me on there. DM me, d talk directly with me. I'm going to start a Discord server just as soon as I can so we can chat more frequently. But I've also, many of you have asked how you can help the channel. I asked about a Patreon or Minds.com. I've created a Minds.com for the quartering. And I also have a Patreon should you choose uh, to do so. You don't, absolutely, you don't have to. Um, but if you want to help support the channel, I can guarantee you that 100% of the money that gets pledged via Patreon, I put back into the channel. The first couple of things I'm going to do is create a dedicated set. So I have a lot of the pieces behind me over there. So I'll just create a separate set for this channel as rather than sharing Unsleep Media, um, improved audio, things like that will be the very first thing I do with the patron pledges. There are different levels where you can get accreditation in the video, shout outs, all sorts of stuff like that. I just, again, no matter what, I'm so thankful for all of you. And uh, I look forward to talking with you on Twitter and, and here in the comments and on Patreon and everything. I'm so, so thankful uh, for, for all of you. We'll talk uh, probably sooner than you think.